Hey Sexy, welcome to day 2 of Terrorthon. Today we are going to be discussing Centralia in Pennsylvania, the real life Silent Hill. Founded in the 1700s, the town was first known as Bull's Head because of a tavern that opened there with that name. It was then later changed to Centerville before finally becoming Centralia. There are coal mines around Centralia which are still active today, mostly through bootlegging. The first mines were opened in 1856 and they were known as Locust Run Mine and the Coal Ridge Mine. On May 27, 1962, f firefighters set the town landfill on fire and although there are conflicting reports as to what exactly started the fire, the main theory is that this fire leaked into the abandoned coal mines underground. Uh, the fire is still burning today. Sinkholes began to open, residents were falling into them, including a 12-year-old boy who had to be rescued by his 14-year-old cousin. And toxic gas and smoke began to emanate all throughout the town, which is still a problem to this day. In 1983, all of the residents of Centralia were relocated thanks to $42 million allocated by Congress for relocation efforts. Today, there are only 11 people estimated to still be living in Centralia. Most of the houses and buildings have either been demolished or reclaimed by nature today. Now, there's not much to see in Centralia if you go nowadays, but there is the famous Graffiti Highway which was closed permanently quite recently actually. I personally have had the fortune of getting to visit Centralia as evidenced by this picture here and the guy in the shark head. It was a very interesting experience and if you get the chance you should go sooner rather than later and visit this ghost town, the real life Silent Hill.